Yes, mates, today I've come down to the Centre Ives. Massive, mate, Centre Ives, mate. I don't know why it's called Centre Ives, and uh, I'll probably find out over time, mate. So we'll go and look around St. Ives. It's like in a place in the middle of nowhere, mate. And uh, it looks like to me, it's a place for emits, mate. Literally, emits are everywhere around here, mate. I think that's what they call them down in Cornwall, mate. We call them grockles in Devon, mate. But here they're emits. So um, if I got that right, I'm going to really stupid if I haven't, mate. So um, I'm an emit today, mate. And I'm going to have a look around and see what's... Uh, going on in the St. Ives, isn't it? It's the centre, I suppose, a bit of it, mate. We play found the co-op, mate. Boom, we found that. That's usually a pretty easy game, mate. You always find a co-op, no matter where you go. So, I don't know what we're going to look into next, mate. A lot of clothing shops, a lot of fashion shops, mate. Probably one-off expensive shops, mate, to keep the holiday makers happy. But, um, we shall see and uh, find what to do next, innit? Right, it's never knew this place was going to be so busy for visitors, mate, literally everywhere. There's visitors everywhere, mate, and it's like a, being stuck in a maze with visitors. So, going down to the bottom now, mate, I might even have a little visit on the beach, mate, and see what's uh, going on there. And proper... find what else I can get up to, innit? Alright, oh, I've been trying to find a few things to do down here, mate. A couple of things I'm definitely going to come back for another day, mate, or in the future or something. They do boat rides, mate. They like property tonight, high speed boat rides, mate. And uh, they're all booked up because of all the um, visitors, mate. And uh, what are you looking at, Mr. Seagull? I ain't got food for you. And um, basically, I can't do it. So, go a bit more of a wander around, mate. Looks like it's about to shut on my head. And uh, see what I can, uh, what I can do, but... Up, uh, this is like people everywhere down here mate, it's like they're having like one massive illegal rave and it's not even Dartmoor. You know I heard about this place before mate, I couldn't think where, I remember a uh, friend John Wilder mentioning it mate, he said uh, it's a creepy mate, but it seems more friendly to me mate. And he said like uh, there's ghosts around here, that's normally him mate, and he was uh, telling me about uh, um, exorcism he did here once mate, and uh, I was kind of eaten by demons. Yeah, mate, in his own world, mate, in his own world, but proper... Uh, I'm snap, I'm snap dickhead in a while, actually, thinking about it. Who he is now? He's still in prison or something for, like, uh, I don't know, marriage fraud or for marrying people so they can stay in the country. That's, that's what he normally used to do, mate, and he used to charge them that back to the ground at the time. Made a minute, I don't know, because uh, he was getting them, actually, marriage licence and forging details and stuff. Like finally walk around the whole lot mate, it's quite a big area to be honest mate, I'd walk all the way around mate and uh, dodging the old age pensioners with their walking sticks mate, if you get so much the other way mate you get a whack around these parts and uh, probably brockles from some other place or whatnot but proper um, seagulls seem to be quite gangster down here mate, I think this place is owned by the seagulls and I'm just going off the bottom here mate to see what's uh, going down. If you're trying to find a toilet in this place, mate, I wish you the very best of luck, mate. I haven't been able to find anything that so much remotely resembles the toilet, minus the sea, mate, and uh, can't really do that around here for obvious reasons, mate. So, um, proper... What's that smell, mate? Feels like a fish has farted or something, but... Proper... This is like coming to Spain without the El Spanyol, mate, literally. It's I mean, the seas are absolutely beautiful. Oh, mate, take a look at that, mate. Look at him. I've just seen a dolphin, mate. Yeah, mate. It's, there's no real big those dolphins, but I've never seen a dolphin before, mate. Yeah, I'm not talking echo. I'm not saying that, mate. I'm talking the dolphin, mate. swim and I was just like mate that's a dolphin I like dolphins mate it's uh proper all right down here mate I like it down here seeing the dolphins and that. I wonder where they go when it's not so hot though mate I do wonder uh, the water's down here like crystal clear you can literally see everything below you mate the boots are like white sand mate and uh you've got boats mate well, mate, it's pretty much done in the Yoda set on these massive, so uh, proper, I've had a good time down here, mate, and I'll probably head back soon. I think this is near the end of me uh, Cornwall adventures now, mate. Where I come from Cornwall, are you? Um, proper, I think I've nearly been everywhere. We've got the right bottom of Cornwall to do, mate, and a couple of areas that are not going to be easy to access, like 
the arse are silly or things like that, mate. Yeah, mate, they caught the arse are silly because silly people live on it, mate. We'll probably get there one day, mate, but I don't know when. Uh, maybe sooner than we think, who knows? But uh, big up the set. Oh, it's massive, isn't it? 